How to create an air purifier for your residence using your own hands. In order to accomplish this, you will require a filter obtained from either a Kamaz or a Maz vehicle, any substantial size filter of significant magnitude. You will also require a typical computer cooler. Here is one available for purchase at a price of 300 rubles. Any type of wire connectors will suffice for the purpose of connecting wires together and a 12 volt power supply will be perfectly adequate and suitable for the task at hand. There must be a power supply that is specifically 12 volt because in order to start the cooler you need at least 12 volts. The number of amps is not important. In order to operate our cooler we need to establish a connection between it and the power supply unit. Connect the black wire to the black one and the red one to the red one. Stick two black wires into one terminal same thing with red wires, the yellow wire is the ground, we definitely don't need it here. We connected the wires using wire connectors. It's more convenient than using electrical tape. Connect the plug and perform a check. Confirm that everything is functioning properly. Our cooler, specifically the fan, is starting up and operating as expected. Simply place our cooler on the air filter of the Kamas and you're ready to proceed. The air purifier is ready. The air will be sucked in from the top and come out through the side walls. By filtering out dust, viruses and bacteria, all that is left to do is to screw it in using some screws and then it will be ready for immediate use. Important point. When choosing an air purifier and cooler, make sure to choose one with the same diameter of the holes so there are no empty spaces on the edges. Because they come in different types, air filters and coolers. This is a 12 cm cooler, a computer fan and an air filter from a Maz truck. They can also be somewhat different, even from Maz they can be dissimilar. To start you need to buy a cooler, then take it to the auto shop and get the correct air filter. And there's one more vital thing to keep in mind. When choosing a power supply, for the phone everything in the power supply is 5 volts. They will not work. I just got fortunate, you could say, to find precisely this power supply. He's for iPhone, iPad, he's on 12 volts, the number of amps doesn't matter. It is merely a tad necessary for the cooler. Consequently, any individual will suffice for the task at hand. But the number of volts is important, it needs to be 12 volts. He starts up, only starts with 12 volts. You can find one like that too. I found one at the communication salon. Power supply for 200 Russian rubles. So the air filter costs from 400 to 600 Russian rubles. The cooler is priced at 300 rubles and the power supply is priced at 200 rubles. Therefore, our total comes to 1000 rubles, if I'm not mistaken. And two screws provide additional information. They will effortlessly penetrate the malleable metal and firmly fasten our cooler. An argument could be made that it would be more efficient to manually position a fan of this kind as opposed to using automated methods. However, that is not going to be any better because the fans are extremely loud. Okay, observe this. I am switching on the fan. In my opinion, you can hear perfectly on the camera the extent of his loudness at this present moment in time. At this very instant, I am proceeding to turn on the cooler device in order to lower the temperature and create a more comfortable environment. Here he is working. Cannot hear a damn thing. He can work both day and night will not bother you while you are sleeping in the bedroom. The typical monthly electricity consumption is approximately 2, 3 rubles, costing around that amount per month. So you don't even have to turn it off. But the air in the apartment really becomes much much cleaner and much less dust settles on the floor. Thank you all for paying attention. Please give me a like if this video was even slightly helpful to you. Subscribe to the channel. I regularly post interesting tips, life hacks, and just some fun videos. I reckon y'all might find it interesting to see something else useful.